Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome. Welcome to Stocks with Show Play of the Day. This is five. Uh, five was a beautiful bearish gap today and took it before it even broke. Nice, nice trade today. Completely out of this, although this did go down to 35.54, it looks like, yeah. And I'm not saying this is done for the day, but time of the day is close to lunch, and I just don't like to trade in the afternoon. No one should trade in the afternoon on Friday, unless you're in something that's just falling like a brick during a short or a rally. It doesn't make any sense to trade in a Friday. So nice, nice bearish gap. I did do an open house today, so I had quite a lot of people in the room today, saw me do it. I did not tape the room today, but this was a nice bearish gap. You can take a look here at the bigger chart. Uh, and I took this very early on. Perfect entry in here. Perfect, perfect, perfect everything. Let's go over it. I know it's patient too. Oh, it's so patient. So, stock opened, rallied. The only thing I decided to do today was to not get over 38, which it didn't, didn't even get close to it. And an ideal world would have held 37.50. It went up to 37.67. Anyways, okay, so here we have it. And I shorted this in this bar, boom, came down, fell, rallied up, another setup in here, dropped. I'm in this short, and all along the while here, people are, are attempting to buy this. You can see people coming in to buy it here, 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 here. All along in here, people are trying to buy the low. Why are traders trying to buy this today when it was a short? Because it is a short. I had the right directional bias. I had to wait a while, though, for this to really get going. Although I was up in this the whole time up or flat in here waiting, but this is a long time for me to wait for a trade to break because usually they go so fast, we're spoiled here. Uh, even though it broke in here, it pushed back. You have to know what to do. People bought this and that were traders today, but it was a short. Why? Because it was an institutional short today. And so, But I know that traders were trying to buy this today. They're trying to buy this into the prior support. But it was a good bearish gap, so the thing to do is to short it, okay? And I rated the gap today per my 26-point rating system. And that is how I know to do a stock like this, to short it today and not to buy it. And if you don't know how to rate a gap like me, which the only way you'd know is if you did my class. If you did, never did my class, you wouldn't have known that five was a short today. You probably got stopped out of this going long it if you even did anything with five today. And now, of course, this is coming up on everyone's scanner in the world. And this might actually get some short play in this afternoon and drop down to 35. But... And so because the market's dropping a little bit today, but I think that really the ticket is always to get the best entry and always to get in the morning. And I don't like to trade in the afternoon. You can wait all day long and get stuff on scanners. If you do that, you're getting like, you're missing 80% of the move. What's the point? I like to get this immediately. If it triggers and rates well for the 26 point rating system, which this did. And I said, this is the top watch today and it worked. It worked the best and I did it. So it's one of these days where skill triumphed over everything else. It usually does. You must know how to trade to take a position. You have to know how to do things. Uh, trading is easy if you know how to trade. Trading is challenging if you don't. It is easy to learn what to do if you find someone on the planet like me to teach you. What my 26-point rating system does is train your eye as a student, if you come to me and learn from me, how to read a chart like this correctly. Because the point rating system trains your eye. I'm training your eye to learn whether or not five should have been bought today or shorted. And five should have been shorted today and was shorted and is a short. But there were trainers out there today that were buying five and they lost in it. And so what are you going to do? It wasn't a buy. But you have to learn to be able to read institutional positioning. How do you know the gap rating system, which teaches you what institutions are doing the chart and also teaches you how to take it, the right directional bias, and it trains your eye. And this is something that this is, this is why it's so valuable. This is why for me to charge $3,000 for the class is like, it's like so cheap because the training that you gain and learn from me training your eye to learn how to do this will last forever or should. You, I'm training your eye to know how to train the thing. Anything, anything in a gap, long or short. So five was a beautiful short today, stood with it, stuck with it, had to be patient, never did anything wrong, 
Great bearish gap today. Broke late, but held on to it. Beautiful gap, preempted the break right, right on target. I just nailed this sucker today. Someone said again today on a bearish queen, I'm really going to have to buy a crown. That'll be a funny email. <laughs> Maybe I should do that today. Anyways, have a wonderful day, everyone. Have a great weekend. The Golden Gap course is this weekend. If you want to sign up, today's the deadline. 5 o'clock Eastern time, that's it. Email me at melissathesockswish.com if you want to sign up and learn actually how to do what I do. Learn how to trade the gaps. I'm offering January and February in the room for free. That's a great deal for anyone that's doing the class this weekend. That's a smashing deal because you can take trades like today and other trades I've done this week, APL, the five, and make the money back for the class just following my trades. So, you know. It's like a no-brainer for people that have been following me. I have no idea what people are waiting for. They're probably waiting for the day where I just don't do it anymore, which is not going to be something that I'll ever announce, by the by. So, you know, my career is shaking off. Things are going great. The business is booming. My trading has never been better. And 2015 is going to be the year that you want to day trade with anyone with me. If you're interested in more information, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Thanks, everybody. Have a great weekend.